I know, I shouldn't upload such videos, and there are better things to show you, but it is me, and so I'm going to upload this. I'll try to keep this as quick as possible, and as usual, we'll start with the official what the fuck Ubuntu blog. So, Glimpse is a result of 4 months intensive work, and in those 4 months, the only thing they did was to change the brandy. Oh, I'm sorry. They did one more thing. They rebase on an older GIMP version, so it is a worse software since the initial release. And this article is pretty much accurate. Because if we go to the official Glimpse blog, we will see that they actually have only changed the branding, plus some paths, so Glimpse and GIMP can coexist in a system. And from now on, this release announcement only gets better. So they thank the community for the overwhelmed support, and I'm not sure what exactly they smoke, because every post I've read about this fork, is negative at the best, but usually is some hate comment. Oh! And on their official Twitter, the release announcement tweet is 14 likes, 4 reshares, and none comment. If you type Ubuntu sucks, it will give you more. I know from personal experience. And it gets so much better. So, they considered a good idea to mention they donated $50 in GIMP, like they donated 50 millions. Obviously they are so stupid that can't realize how bad that sounds, and not to mention, how pissed GIMP developers are with this fork. Actually, I don't even think they give a fuck, but certainly they aren't happy watching someone stealing their work, and even insulting them. Everything started from this bug report, that says GIMP name is offensive so they need to change it, and there is a link that shows the definition on Urban Dictionary. According to that, GIMP may be used to call someone incompetent or stupid, or to describe someone as a sex slave as this was used on Pulp Fiction Movie. Fact is, GIMP name was originally inspired by Pulp Fiction, and when I called Glimpse developers stupid before, I was just returning them the characterization. Because when you call the name offensive, you obviously insult the people who picked it too, since they already know exactly the meaning, and decided that the name was fine, and personally I agree. To be completely fair, there are some people that do like this effort. But you know, people are usually idiots, and so we have Donald Trump for president. I just didn't expect that to happen in open source that people are supposed to be a little bit smarter. So, let's see the actual brandy. That's Glimpse icon. That's a splash screen, and by the way I got it installed from Flathub, so at least they made one thing right. And that's the about dialogue with all the people working hard on rebranding. So, speaking of rebranding, we can't but mention the king is stealing the work of others and giving his shit back. The one and only, Ubuntu. And the last thing, I want your feedback if you consider the name Baby Wobe offensive. Because if so, I can rebrand to motherfucking Baby Wobe.